folks here at Two Wheel Thunder, the gentleman standing right next to me, you've seen him on our program before. You've seen the product on our show. It's a product that I not only use, but I think is a fantastic product. But they come out with even a better product than you had before. I didn't think you could do it, but you've actually improved it. Now, Jamie's going to tell us about that brand new product and how much better it is. We've actually came out with the G4. This product's going to allow us to do four people on two bikes at one time with a mile distance. Wow. It's going to also support A2DP, true Bluetooth stereo. Oh, really? Exactly. It's got <laughs> amplified speakers. Oh, nice. For your music. Nice. It has a built-in FM radio. Wow. bringing the stations a lot cleaner and clearer than previous models. Cool. Also can do the three bikes on the mile distance, all can talk as once. Our previous models only did two bikes, right. so this will do the three. Wow. And this is still available at any of your local shops. It's still distributed by uh, Parts Unlimited, Tucker Rocker, and Western Power Sports. Yeah. Now, if they need really want to get technical, they can go to your guys' website? Exactly, at www.cardosystems.com. And if they need anything, if they can't find it at the dealer, you can find it there on your website. Exactly. Okay. Now, one of the things I noticed is that you did talk about it up to a mile. I noticed they do have a slight antenna. You can extend the range on these? Yes, you can extend the range by popping the antenna up. That will give you the extended range. Also, bringing the FM stations a lot clearer. That's it? That's it. Wow. So you can use our existing helmet. Exactly. Does it need to be four-face, three-quarter, or what size helmet? Use any kind of helmet you want as long as it has something over your ears for ear flaps. Okay. Also, the unit is backwards compatible with our complete lineup. So for the guys out there with the old ones, you buy this, you can still use it with your buddy. That'd be me. And also another one, it's got the cool Zumo little USB port for software upgrades. Oh, nice. So as, as we continue to develop software, right. go to our website, download the new stuff, it's all good to go. Cool. Cool. Now, this is available right now? It's available right now at your local dealer. Right now. Great. Well, I'll tell you what, Jamie, this product, like I said before, I've used it before. It's been fantastic. I didn't think you could improve it, but I think you actually have. It's great. It's a great unit. I've been using it. It's perfect. Great. I'll tell you what, if you want to communicate between passenger rider, if they have their own bike and you want to communicate, this is the way to go. Also, if you're riding in a pack, you want the front person to have communication with the rear end of the pack. That way, if somebody gets caught in the red light, you can communicate with that front rider and tell them, hey, you know, I'm stuck at a light so you don't get left behind. Exactly. So, folks, one way to go, definitely use this product. I'll tell you, it works for me, and I know it's going to work for you. At this time, we'd like to thank everyone for watching this episode of Two Wheel Thunder. If you have any comments about this show or a suggestion for any future show, email us at... Two Wheel Thunder at hotmail.com.